Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is still Saturday, January 1st, 2022. I'm the Drunk Poker Group. Tis single malt whiskey time. American single malt whiskey, cast strength, old line. Thank you to the Maryland Department of Agriculture for sending this out. Uh, from Baltimore, Maryland, old line spirits. This is the strongest liquor I've ever seen in my life. It is 62.3% alcohol. Remember, remember when we thought beer was strong? It's 14.5%. Like, yeah, it's 62.3%. My eye hurts just saying it. Um, thank you for this. I, who knows, man? So this year we're going to try and talk about booze more. Not just beer. I'm finding I like booze. Um, I like liquor. And I like liquor for a very specific reason. You, you only have a little bit, you still, you still sip it. And yeah, and you don't have to go to the bathroom like 300 times a night because, you know, volume. Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, I did take a little tipple of this way back when it came in, but I'll be honest with you, I, I, I had, had a couple other things, so I don't really remember. I do like this. See, it's fancy. Um, so it comes right out of the cask. So it's the cask strength. So there's no filtering, blending, nothing. It's single malt. Um, I'm going to be very tight on the pour here because this is a strong liquor, right? And we've had 50%, I think, 48%. Now, I am learning this. And the funny thing is when I started doing beer stuff, I, I, I had been doing talking about beer for, you know, a year or so ahead of time. I have no background in whiskey, and I'm really going to try and it's just for fun, too, because I like to, I can go back and revisit it later. But let's get into it. Then. Cheers. Whiskey. There's no open flames around here, right? Wow. Oh, that's, that's, uh, that's strong. So it's very smooth, though, which is such a contradiction for me, because I'm learning, right? To beat the whole... Oh. Oh, woo! Hello, nurse! Um, yeah, you're getting like this kind of, and I, I could be completely wrong here. It is very oaky, caramel, vanilla. Um, there's like a cherry note. And the strong oak, and I think that's probably because it comes right out of the cask, I'm guessing. Right? It is boozy. It is warm. It is boozy as all get out. But again, it's a slow sipper. Now, I put two ice cubes in, and I've had discussions with people, I should just drink things neat or put a little bit of water. I like two ice cubes in it. We're getting a new fridge for the basement because I plan on keeping my whiskey in the fridge. I like my whiskey cold. I don't know. That's who I am. And I like how as the ice melts, it opens up the complexities of it, and I'm learning, and that's fun for me. I, just, I don't like it neat. I'm sorry. I'm trying to take slow sips because I really want... Now, I always find the second sip, I'm a little more acclimatized. My body's ready to be like, okay, we know what's coming. And you can taste more things. There's a fruitiness to it. I feel like there's like a citrus. I don't know. That's probably not the right word. But definitely like, yeah, it's, it's, got, it's got character. It's got oomph. And it's fun. So thank you. I, I really enjoy this. Uh, this one will be one of those bottles that I will bust out from time to time. It's not something you're going to pour on a regular basis. Again, 62.3%, and it's the only one I got. And I'm probably never going to get another one, right? Because I don't know. If you can't get this in Canada, maybe it's coming to Canada. That'd be cool. Uh, but you should try it then. 62%, though. Whoa. Remember I was talking the other day about a beer that was 6.8%. I'm like, man, that's really high. I'm like, hello, nurse. Hope you guys have a great Saturday. Take it easy out there. Relax. Pour yourself a whiskey or scotch or bourbon. Oh, I got bourbon too. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a good night. Cheers, my friends. Enjoy your evening. Go enjoy mine. Oh, I do love that burn, though. Oh, that that's a, it's a good burn. It's a good burn. It's a deep burn. <laughs>